Kia ora, bula, talofa. Ni hao. Welcome to Morgan Nuts. My name's Morgan. It's spring, it's beautiful, the blossoms are out, the sound of chainsaws is over there, it's so serene. Today, I'm gonna to be doing a video, I sort of, just to give you a bit of context, I travel um, from Christchurch to Geraldine, and I go down there to visit my mum and dad, and I'm actually traveling back from Geraldine, so I'm traveling north, back to Christchurch. And I thought I would do my four top cafe or coffee shop stops on the way. So the first one's gonna be in Geraldine, and then we'll go to Ashburton, and then we'll stop in Rakaia, and then we'll go to Dunsandle before we end up in Christchurch. These are places that I recommend. I think they've got really great coffee and a great food selection, and I don't stop at all four of them every time I travel, but just to give you an idea of what's, you know, along the way, it kind of punctuates the trip a little bit. You could stop at any of these four places and you will be in coffee heaven, I promise you that. So, let's go to the first cafe in Geraldine, Cafe Verde, before we hit the road north up to Christchurch. Cafe Verde, this is a bit of a favourite of mine and mum and dad's, we always come here. Lovely little spot, gardens out the front, you can sit along the veranda, they've got a really good menu as well, and they do a great coffee, and that's why this is stop number one. can see why this plate is so great, isn't it? It's got this lovely garden area. The coffee is so good, it's delicious, and the staff are really friendly. Mm -mm -mm. Beautiful. So this coffee, I'm gonna go with, um, just to sort of standardize everything, I'm just gonna get like a regular flat white, which this is. This is $5 here at Verde. Coffee prices, I think, are, are going up at the time of filming, so who knows what it's gonna be in the future, but at the moment, five bucks will get one of these beautiful little tulip regular flat whites. They also don't do takeaway coffees anymore, like they, they're trying to decrease the amount of wastage, you know, all that packaging, etc. So you can bring your own sort of vessel for coffee and takeaway and that, and um, they sell reusable cups here as well. So there we go, Cafe Verde, my first stop in my little coffee adventure on the way back from Geraldine to Christchurch. This is um, a great spot. If you're passing by, make sure you come check it out. through Tinwald, if you're coming from the south, you drive through Tinwald first and then you come into Ashburton over the Ashburton River or Hakatere River. Bit of water in there, bit of water in the river, oh yeah. Well that wasn't too hard, that was just a wee loop around the block. Burnett Street is a one-way street on this section anyway, just outside the cafe, but at least we've found it. And there's free 60 minute parking just down there, that's it, just there. This place, it's usually pretty busy. They, they, do, they do a good trade. Um, the coffee's really good. I got my regular flat white, again, $5. Somerset Grocer do take away though as well. What was really cool about this place is, well, it's big, there's loads of space. They've got a really extensive sort of cabinet food range and a, and a full kind of menu as well, or an all day menu. There's a cup of tea ice cream, there's loads of smoothies, and I've got these beautiful products on display which you can buy, all sorts of delicious things. What's over there? Coconut crispy rolls, jams, preserves, tea, coffees, relishes. I see some chopping boards and stuff like that. So you could do a little bit of shopping here, a little bit of groceries if you want. Have your coffee, have your scrambled eggs, or whatever your heart may desire. Let's try this coffee. Yeah, great. That's a banger. <laughs> you will not be disappointed. Man, I'm going to be so caffeinated by the end of this trip. Oi, hey, all done. Man, that was a good coffee. Somerset Grocer, absolutely worth checking out if you're coming through Ashburton, or if you live in Ashburton, you should definitely check that. That could be a great local for you. Now I'm just going to jump back in the car. We're going to head to, well, we're going to carry on State Highway 1 North, and our next stop is in a wee place called Rakaia. <laughs> And just when you see that big salmon, you want to turn left. Well, you'll see a toilet sign anyway, but this is where you go if you want to use the bathrooms. At the end of this road, hopefully you'll see a barn sort of situation. There it is there, and you hope like hell it's open. Not looking too good. The Little Red Cafe. Well, this is it anyway. Closed Tuesday and Wednesday. Sue's shopping day is lol. Oh, okay. Well, if you are coming through on Monday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, then 
it'll be open and you'll be able to try the coffee. Really good coffee here as well. That's the Little Red Cafe, just down the end of Rolleston Street. Yeah, well worth, this was the third stop. I often stop here because it's so good. So if you are coming through Rakaia, then the Little Red Cafe is worth checking out. And there's a gift shop in there as well, which is quite cool. Now, well, let's keep heading north. It's a beautiful day, lovely day for a drive. And we will stop next at Dunsandal, our fourth and final coffee shop stop. All right, let's hit the road. Oh, here's a stop sign. I'm gonna come to a complete stop. Better fucking believe it. You better believe it. Ain't no popo gonna give me a fine. Stopping. Clear, going. Here is the Rakaia River Bridge. It's a doozy. Often on this bridge, I will hold my breath. My record so far is traveling 80 k's per hour and being able to hold my breath the whole way across. Any slower than that, can't do it. But that's a, you what, look, look how long this thing is. I reckon that's quite an achievement, just quietly. Don Sando! Just up here on the left, we have the Dun Sandal Store. Here we are with a beautiful looking flat white. This was 550 and it's a little bit bigger than the other regulars. Oh wee. Oh wee. That is a damn fine cup of coffee right there. And the Dun Sandal store have got a full menu as well. They've got a massive um, selection of cold beverages. Uh, there's also a little post shop here as well if you need to post anything. Loads of cool gift stuff and then a full menu as well. Loads of cabinet food, really friendly staff as well, which is always a big one. They've got an outdoor area at the back as well if you want to sit out in the sun. That is a nice flat white, man. <sighs> well, there we go. That was my four, or well, kind of three and a half, favorite coffee shops on my trip from Geraldine to Christchurch. So if you're doing that trip, either way, make sure you uh, stop in at one of them and just see what you think. I'd love to know your thoughts, so make sure you leave a comment. I'll leave all the addresses of them in the description below as well. This whole trip has sort of felt like that song, um, Today, Tomorrow, Tomorrow by Deja Voodoo from Brown Sabbath. I've sort of gone to all the places that they yell out at one part in the song. <laughs> But it's really cool. Man, I'm so caffeinated, but it's been a great wee trip. I usually, as I said, I don't stop at all those places on the way. I usually just stop at one, maybe one coffee for the whole trip, but I've had uh, three, so that's been good. Thank you so much for watching. If you like what I'm doing, please give us a like and subscribe and give us a share. Why not? Let's put it out there. My name's Morgan. Thanks so much, and you take care. We'll see you in the next video. Yeah.